Hello my friends, and welcome back to our continued blind let's play, Jimmy and the Pulsating Mask. My name is the Flatless Bird, this is your Soybeans Gaming Channel, and joining with us is the King of the Giant Robots, Azappa. I'm here to guide you through all the shiny nooks and spooky crannies of this eight-year-old child. It sounds like quite an adventure, so let's go ahead and continue, shall we? It was a good party member. He's my only other magic attacker. Oh, Jimmy, I can't find your favorite toy anywhere. I'm sorry. Oh, and after we just found him, too. I know how much it meant to you with Grandma giving it to you and all. We'll see about getting you another one, but they're just so expensive. Maybe if you're a very good boy, we'll get you one for... For, for Christmas this year. I'll talk it over with your father. Hey, I don't have last night, but I'm glad that bear is gone. It shows the babies anyway. Oh, we're down to three characters again. And, and and this game did the very brilliant thing that some games back in our heyday wouldn't do. Yep, which is remove your equipment for you rather than just throw it all in the fire. Yep. Thanks for saving Gotcha. Most of the time he's alone. Sometimes you wish you could be the but like the toy you burns. You know what it's like to be filled with life? Gotcha doesn't have the luxury of a spirit, he's just a body. Oh, hey, that, that hey, is Hey, it's a penguin! Going. It's Koala. And, oh, this is a penguin, yes. Yeah. How do I get the information guy? Oh, you it's don't. a penguin down there. He was just kind of there to exist, and now he's gone. Part of the window dressing. But I just wanted you to be Jimmy for, for, for dramatic effect. That's all. I got you. So, what do you think that scene was all about? You want to speculate about it? No idea? The idea of going old? No. I don't know. What do you want me to? Do you want me to tell you? Is this a spoiler? The game will tell you very, very later in the game. Well, then it's a spoiler, so don't tell me. Alright then. That, that's why I phrased everything the way I did. Ashby's! Weird place. What's up with that name? Huh. Ashby's. No, it's just just designed weird. Help! Yeah, I see that. Walk. Like a mall. Bank. <laughs> Midnight sharp dressed man. Door down there. It's a jar. No, it's a door. It's not a jar. Fair enough, you got me on that one. <laughs> I don't Wait, know what that is. The face. The world beyond. Seems like a place to take a break. An actual lay down, take a nap. You remember all of that, Jimmy? Oh, of course you do. Because I won't let you forget. Jimmy can see the ghost is reflection this time. It's a reflective surface. School is super lame. I wish I were a rad ghost. Alright, ghosts are too cool for school. I guess 
what's happening when the lame kid dies? He became a lame ghost, like me. We're gonna get the children so we can grow clothes. Grow school is about to start. Like, ew, the skin and muscle and bones are still last year. Can you believe you're filled with blood and stuff? Gross. Oh boy, an actual child. I bet you're ready for some real mischief, aren't you, young man? Let's see if we can help you out. New types of bombs. A oh, smoke bomb is the one item that you missed out getting from uh, Rubik. Yeah, I noticed all these are from him. We just didn't get to him in the fourth season. I wonder what the smokey does. Jimmy Brush is awesome, though. I think that says something different for every form. We're gonna ask because it's, it's a mall for ghosts. It wasn't always, but it is now. You can still shop here if you want, but some people find it awkward, it's all. Jimmy looks like missing, but it's hard to tell. Jimmy's clothes look a little loose. Everyone wonders if they have an arcade. Jimmy can see right through his reflection. Jimmy wonders if he needs to start shaving now. Jimmy wonders if the beak is too big. Jimmy can't stop smiling at his own reflection. Aww. It's totally worth it. Can I get you some, Jimmy? Ooh. Physical holy damage. Too tight cooldown. And the other two items. I'll be back. Does this thing as ghosts, right? Then why do they keep paying Inca Coast cash? Try it again. Let's try this again. <laughs> The question is, do I want to get any more points? Oh, let's oh, go. No. Oh, I got another magic user, it would be really useful. Ugh, I want to give it to her. Crush. Yeah, I give it to Crush, I say. Because she's a speedster, she doesn't do much physical damage. Let's do this again. Because you have to click the button to advance, except for that screen. When it comes up to the number, you don't click the button. Is there not any other places up there? Well, that's my first time in a mall. There are so many stores here. I mean, sure, a lot of them are run down. And yeah, the rest are owned and operated by Ghost is Super Spooky. Ah, uh, there's just something horrifying happened here a year ago. Still, I kind of want a souvenir. Everything get another postcard from mom. I make sure I send her one every time I stop somewhere. And that's why you always want to talk to them. Ooh, can't go throw your hands off me. Ghosts don't sweat. It's like we always just got out of the shower. If I were rag ghost, I won't let get away with bullying me. Are you excited for ghost school? Oh, I bet you go to normal school. There aren't hardly any ghosts here at all. How boring. Remember when you used to shake me around and smile? I guess things haven't changed much. What happens if you don't shake him and smile? Does it still say that? Oh, I don't know. Yo, what's up, Bohai? The secret about rad ghosts. You gotta be really rad dude to become a rad ghost when you die. And I'm the raddest. Dude! Just remember, I got a jet. Spell you later. Wow, you actually left? <laughs> Be 
How would sharp dress man? We specialize in ghost clothes. Maybe you could just some more older clothes for you. Big magic defense. Horrible defense, though. Kind of mid. Is this sleep? Like, I can understand why this could be good. Like, if I was playing Legend of Dragoon and I had Congo in my party, this would be perfect for Congo. Because he already has massive defense, but not a lot of magic defense. Right. But I don't think any of these characters are that hard up. Yeah, I mean, even Buck only has a 58 defense. Sure, his magic defense would go through the roof, but if I unequip his... Didn't mean to do that. Oops. <laughs> it's okay, I knew what I had. So, he has a 44-29. Uh, Huh? I mean, and, he had the winter coat. Yeah, I mean, I could always equip him with the uh, chance to evade. That wouldn't be a bad item, but still, I don't think the magic defense item is still better for him. Oh. Because, I mean, Jimmy has a magic defense 36. What has a high magic defense than he does? You would have to know you're going into a fight that has really a lot of magic attack happening. Exactly. Another reflective surface. Yeah, we've already done that. Oh, a customer. This has been so slow recently. Ghosts tend not to be very heavy eaters. Quick game it goes right through that. Ahem. <laughs> Do you like a table? Right this way, sirs. Madam. And he goes right through you. Welcome to midnight. I'll give you more to pursue our reviews on my new. Oh, it all looks so good. I'm gonna have trouble choosing. What are you getting, Jimmy? Eh, probably something out the kids' menu. If that's what he wants, then fine. This will be my treat, boys. You can have whatever you want. Thanks, Mom. Have you made a decision? I have a question, actually. How big is the chocolate tart? It's quite large, madam. Perhaps you would like to share? Oh, hmm. uh, That won't be necessary. All to myself. I'll take the grilled salmon. Oh, that sounds good. But bring out the chocolate tart first. <laughs> and a bottle of wine. <laughs> Excellent choice, madam. And for the gentleman? Hey, I'll take the tea boo. Can I substitute something for the baked potato? I don't need empty carbs. Of course, sir. Would you like the house salad or one of our other sides? Yeah, hey, I'll have another. Uh, I'll take a French onion soup. I love French onion soup. That's so good. <laughs> oh, I'll take another tea boo. Oh, well, I'll see what I can do. And for you, sir? Um, Make your selection. Choose your food. So good. I like chicken. Excellent choice, sir. I'll be back shortly with the orders. He went for the nuggies, everyone. He went for the nuggies. It's been so long since we had... Oh, that's yours. It's been so long since we had a nice meal together as a family. Hey, I like chicken nuggets. They're good. I just wish the larger your father were here. You've looked for them so hard. Kind of. Not really. Sometimes I wonder if we'll ever find them. We're just kind of being dragged along on a weird path. Yeah, the dots. Don't worry about it, Mom. Buck? Are you trying to cheer me up? Hey, what? No. I was, um... <laughs> oh, you're so precious. Well, as long as I have two boys, I'll be happy. If I were to lose one of you, I wouldn't know what to do. Here we are. For the lady, our chocolate tart, and our finest red wine. 
The same should be optional. The jumping are T-Bot stick, one of uh, another T-Bot stick. The young man with the impeccable taste are finest chicken nuggets. I'm giving you three kinds of dipping sauce to each nugget. We did a little different. Oh, that's amazing. That's great. I like that. That's lame. Only three nuggies. Yeah, I know, but I like the many sauces. Uh, yes. Feel free to mix and match. Well, no, he didn't say only three nuggies. What bon appetit. As the family should say us the plates to find them, because the crystal cloud is about to corner. In fact, what is funny is not other than three plates covered in cold, thick blood? Yeah! Edges of the pool of blood on each plate have begun to coagulate into a grimy skin? Yeah, it's starting to scab over. Man, I'm not eating this. Come on, Buck! I know it wasn't what you expected, but this is ghost cooking after all. We don't want to offend them, I think. Mm. Mm. Uh, it, it's a bit... Bloody? Coppery. Jimmy, why don't you try some? No, thank you. Jimmy dips his spoon into a pool of blood. It coats all your tents like red crude oil. Jimmy's hand begins to shake as he brings it up to his mouth. A blood droplet trips off and splatters onto the table. tablecloth. The spoon inches towards his mouth. He gulps. His lips part. <coughs> Are you right, Mom? I felt something brush up against the back of my neck. I apologize for that. The building has bad wire. Is everything else okay? No! This food sucks! Fuck! No, ma'am, I understand. I know that our food isn't as fresh as we prefer. It's been a long time since we've had a customer. If we're being honest, this isn't what we ordered. You see, I had the chocolate tart, for instance, but what you've given me just seems to be blood. I'm sure it's delicacy, but, well, it's not chocolate. Ugh. This is quite embarrassing. I'm sorry about it. I'll take this back to the kitchen right now and have a little chat with our chef. I hope the chef doesn't give us get in trouble. Oh, we shouldn't have caused the scene. I'm not a Karen, I'm a Helga. Hopefully oh, we just ate that blood. Ew. We should check in with the chef. Make sure his feelings aren't hurt. Yeah, whatever. Oh, go check in with the ye chef. Ah. Oh. It's a vampire. And it's not even a kitchen. Yeah. The door is locked. Yep, is a vampire. Ooh. Uh, 50 style of vampire! No cry. Only undead. Forty I didn't even realize this took 40 MP. And half your HP. I knew that half the HP, I didn't know about the 40 MP. Nice. 
I'll see you to today's sexy vampire's condo. I want a guard on this one. Could have probably stunned him if I was paying attention to him. Destroying this guy. It's as if you came in already prepared to fight the undead for some weird reason. Super ability. Let's go for the kill. Nice. <laughs> uh. Level twenty two all around. Now, I want you to do this next bit in your vampire voice. Jimmy imagines himself flying to the night sky. Blah, blah. Tonight is a haunting night. He is mad and tired. It has been too long since he says the blood on his lips. Oh, for man walks alone down a parlor street. Check Harry's upper park filled with groceries. Jimmy swoops in. He lunges for her warm neck. Jimmy ignores the woman's screams as the light hides from her. He doesn't care anymore. His heart is a beating cold and black. As his victim slumps to the ground, she drops her bar. A jar of monolithic shatters, sticking the deep red contents across the concrete. Jimmy dabs at his mouth with his cart. He notices a storefront window next to him, barely visible from a dim street lamp. He looks at the reflection and sees the street lamp, the lip body of the Vermont, the top to work of groceries, but he doesn't see himself. So he looks deeper. The scene in the window begins to shift. The moon dips below the horizon. The shadows recede. Soon the scene in the window is a golden summer day. The woman is alive there. She's walking down the street, hand in hand with her daughter. Jimmy remembers a time when he walked in the sun. His cheeks remember the warmth. He remembers the laughter of childhood. He reaches towards the window, wanting to dip his hand back into that world. But the scene ripples like a disturbed pond and vanishes. Jimmy thinks he feels a twinge in his heart, but that can't be. His heart is a beating cold and black. The world is no longer for him. Oh. Jimmy can turn into a 50 style vampire. As a 50 style vampire, Jimmy can turn into a horrible monstrosity to scare some things. You can also enter mirrors, ooh, and other reflective services explode walls inside. You got two new verbs. Whoa. You can scare things. Ah, the magic defense one. Okay. All right. So, do you want to? Go get some stuff you've missed. 
Uh, hold on, let me read this first. Drain health oh, yeah. the enemy for 100% physical damage. That's awesome. Uh, convert your mana to usable energy. So this is the energized. Yeah, it is called energized. Uh, create a wall of dark energy around yourself. Reflect magic. And terrible shadows are up from the ground. 400% magic damage. Wow, that's amazing. Level 40. Tangible error. Just wow. Just straight up huge magic defense. Uh, you're going to have a hard time explaining the blood off in your parents. Temp oh! Ho, ho, ho. I like that a lot. It's really hard to get though. Yep. I, I like the cute little vampire though. Wasn't expecting to get another form so quick. <laughs> So yeah, there's uh, reflective surfaces that you need to investigate. I know, but did you say uh, you wanted to go get some stuff I missed? Yeah, that's what I was saying. There's reflective oh, yeah. surfaces. Oh well, yeah, we've done that anyway. Things to spook, mirrors to investigate. How far back do you want to go? How about this far back? I don't know what to do. This mouse started crying when we saw that doll. I don't have any other one stock though. This mouse was stuck crying. Mr. Mouse. Hotel at the end of the world. We got a new shipment toys here, you crazy bits. This mouse doesn't even notice you, just keep crying. I'm a horrible person for thinking about that, but you know. There's another mirror upstairs. Uh huh. Might want to take some money with you. Okay, thanks for the heads up. How much? Um, I could go by memory, or I can actually look. Let me just take it all. I think it was two thousand. Not there. The other Sorry, channel. I couldn't find the chef. He might be uh, taking his cake to the drag leaders. Oh, yeah, it's 2000. Yeah. The stores are closed today. Wait, hee hee hee. I have something, something nice. Yours with the Severed hand. Not looking to buy, maybe look to sell. Hey, hey, hey. What are you selling? All right, so we're done with this area. Um, uh, for now, we're not done with progress, but if we're going to backtrack, we're done for now. We're gonna run it back. Go hit up a uh, clubhouse. You can just walk through. Oh, so we could use the teleport. Or you could see if you want to switch to the, uh, that severed hand. Wow, Plus that's three luck. luck. I wish I could see what the current thing is. Like, uh, it could tell me when I'm replacing. I I've, I've got the list. I can look that up. And I have four of this would be set. Uh, snake hat rack is plus two magic attack. 
cheese. Plus two magic attack. Flower. Rose table plus three regular attack. All right. Where are we going? Home flower. Got lots of fun things we can do here. There's somewhere to go everywhere. Let's go to Cloudy Hill. What's right? Uh, either way works. I'm actually the bottom side. Yeah. I don't want to go into that side. question mark area until we have like. No, no, no. Four party members. No, no, no. We're not going there. Uh, we're going to head to the upper side. Right? Also, yeah, now you can get through both sides. Now you're no longer gated. The right. Your other right. <laughs> Where is he? Where is he? Okay, he's not around here. He's on the other side then. I'm wrong. A gap. Did we not get this earlier? Matter of fact, you can use Grumble there to see how many... Ah, okay, that's the second half. Grumble Bear will tell you if we have any open boxes. What is this? They're closed boxes. Well, we're going to figure that out. We can't do anything here. Let's move on. Let's get back to the other side of the wall. go. We have new verbs. Oh, I'm in rain. Man, it's almost like water could fill up a hole. Mm -hmm. I was thinking the same thing. Isn't it nice to have all your verbs? Yeah. Yeah. We can go out of here and we have spider zone. You have the correct verse for spider zone. Oh, is that that place I went to and got that weapon? Icky goo? Yeah. How do I get back there? It's in uh, Giant Garden. And there's uh, another really small memory dungeon we can go to as well. Really let's small, really easy to get to. Let's do this one first. All right. Uh, yeah, we need. We need six. I think, yeah, I think we can get there. We can get there. Oh, it's the same. Screen. Let's take number four. Or well, unless there's a six up there at the top. There isn't. I remember. And then we can go the right. No, I want to go. Okay, four this is the four exit. is to the exit. The right. I one of them. Get up. I think we can get around there. Yeah, there nice. we go. And then six somehow pops us out back near an exit. All right, so we go to the left. Find your new verbs. There you go. You did it. So, uh, trigger warning: cartoon spiders. That's awesome. up. 
And then if you get lost, you can use your... Do that, yeah. Oh. Now, if these are too challenging, we can always just back out. Welcome to new enemies. Oh, nope, we're out. I'm pretty sure we're dead. I didn't realize there was that much of a spa uh, disparity. Oh my god, that was... That was insane. Right. My bad. But then, also... How do you feel about that depiction of Spider? Is that too much for you? No, that's fine. I, I don't really have arachnophobia or something. Okay, and, but it's bugs, so... I have cockroach phobia. Okay, no, there's no roaches in this. Oh! The entrance. You just go up. Why can't... Right, why can't we ever remember? I always think that you go to two, and the connection is directly up from it. But no, that's wrong. Alright, so we're not going there for a long time. Nope. So we're gonna go back to uh, the wasteland. And we're gonna go go back all the way to the top to where that tent was when we first fought. Punch Tanaka. Here, right? Yeah. The upstairs, I think? Oh, it will still drop you through the hole anyway, whichever. Woo! Uh -uh. I like how the ghost falls through the hole. Oh. It said no because you're not a... You're not a... A, 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 a goo. Does that matter? No, we just go up the other side. I was wrong. No, not that side. The other side. Because that's where it drops us. Oh, okay. It's been a minute. I know this next zone we can handle just fine. Not there, not there. In the tent. There's a mirror. Welcome. Maybe TD and the guys suspect more of a kid's key. Stupid dog. Thanks you can control Punch Tanaka. You can't control Punch Tanaka. Nobody can. Can you control the wind? I mean, that's deep. I'm not trying that down. Gotta keep it shit. Can't let those pity thugs be led by some scrawny shrimp. You found Punch's memory, down. There's nothing here, though. Hey, kid. You don't have to attend a moment of introspection here. So cram it. Hey, you made me screw up this sweet drawing. Good thing Punch Tanaka is patient. That's right, kid. Try all you want. You can't break this perfect form. Oh, there's nothing here, because he's not part of the family. He's just Punch Tanaka. No, he's Punch Tanaka. Uh, my apologies. I'll put some respect on that name. You ever been down here before? I don't think so. This doesn't seem familiar at all. Are there any treasure boxes to get? Let's investigate with a butt though. Oh my god. Fortress of Nitwits. I don't think I've ever gotten that in two of my playthroughs. Nothing else here? Wow, how have I missed that? I'm just that good. I don't think I just ever walked over that far. Well, I figured since we're here. Oh, that's, right, just the, here. that's just the right way. Well, heck. Well, what next? Uh, well, we can't do spiders. We can't do, uh... We're not doing, um, Bird Rock. Let's go back to, uh, yeah, Sweet Melody. Let's go see what was upstairs behind Mom. 
Remember what we found, Mom? There was more to explore in there. Just gotta remember how to get there. Who's all right? And look, two of them are back. Three of them. I'm as much the other one. I call Winsor my cleaning officer. Sets me home too. He was always there. Two were back. Dude, Cam Winsor has been putting me through all sorts of shows when I got back. I know I put on a little weight, but lighten up, geez. Either way it works. Up. Nope. Like, yes. Yes, this is right. And you can turn the alarm back on if you want. All right, enough. Speaking of, did, what about that cake? What cake? Did you ever use the cake that Mom made? No. You still have it? Uh-huh. Now's the time. What do you mean? If you want to use that cake. So I don't need it for later? No. You needed to save the honey, that was it. Also, uh, save your game in case you can't make it out. Yeah, I know. But, uh, you know, so, so the knights have said this. Uh -oh. How they had to capture the queen, and uh, they kind of banished her off. Where do you think they stuck the queen? That seemed to be really powerful. Well, that's rude. Yo, hmm. I think you get to keep it. I know that's why I ran. Oh boy! Oh boy, oh boy! Oh, how happy the queen will be! Oh, but first you must play with me! Greedy, greedy me! You like riddles, yes? My riddles, my riddles are the best! Here's a fun one! What weighs more? A pound of feathers or a pound of dogs? A pound of feathers, a pound of dogs, will play a pound. I'm afraid you're wrong! No, you're wrong <laughs> the world is decidedly a world of black and white. You're either wrong or you're right. And in this case, I'm afraid you're clearly not right. You're wrong, wrong, wrong. You see, a pound has lots of dogs and they definitely weigh more than a pound each. Even the littlest Parmenian weighs a few pounds, so I hope you understand how wrong you are. I'm afraid that right things get rewarded and wrong things get punished. That's the rule here. Well, one of them, <laughs> but probably the most important. You know, rule number one. I'm afraid you're wrong to be very wrong and unnatural in this place. You'll have to be punished before you can see the queen. Hey, you just saved, right? Yep. Load that save. Why was if you choose a dog? Load the save, and we can find out. New title. Hey, title screen, long time no see. Most of it's still the, the same speech. A boy, a boy, a happy, greedy me. You said feathers. Because I'm mashing the button. Right. You see a pound has lots of dogs. Well, no, the, that, but that answer wasn't... Wasn't the... You're wrong. I, I don't know what the first answer actually was. Feathers. Oh, okay.
The wrong, wrong, wrong. A pound is a pound, you see, if you're the chop box of little cubes of meat, measure out a pound. A pound would weigh the same as a pound. The That's what I said the first time. I hope you understand how wrong you are. You suck. But now he's talking about, oh, you chopped up a dog into cubes. But yes, that happens no matter what. Came out of your face. Yeah, you, I, don't, I don't know if you want to fight things here. Uh, or there's gurgle in my throat. It thirsts for a body, but the queen didn't see that the body's way too much. This is all I am now. I want to get and the heck he out of here. I think he's shakeable. Don't say. It's okay, I can exit. Oh, I thought he was shakeable. Too far. I don't think I can kill these things. And I don't think I get any treasures here either until I like fight the boss, right? Yep. So I'm probably just wasting my time. Yeah, a little bit. There's no way I can fight those things. Those things are a little too powerful. And I need an extra person. I need a fourth party member. You definitely would want a fourth party. What do we got? And more time. Um. Let me let me ponder. Let me think. Oh, there's a, there's a room in the Blue Staff River. There's a cave in Blue Staff River. We're going to approach it from... Actually, I don't think it matters. It should be pretty early on. It was where... Well, you can still walk there from here. I yeah, know. Right. I'm going to think it's okay. And unfortunately, you cannot light that campfire. And there we go. Oh, there's that. One next. Like I said, that's what I was trying to think of. I think we're up to date now. So, progress? Progress, yeah. Meaning going all the way back to the, uh, the Grim Echoes? Yep, back to Grim Echoes and back to Ashby. Back to Ashby's? Yeah. Oh, we're done with that place. Oh. So what else did they do here? Remember when we went to go lay down? It's off to the right. The ghost of a reflection. Picked up on that. It just took me a second. Jonathan Bear just sits and stares and stares and stares at the riverside. Jonathan Bear is prone to care of all the things you'll share and the things you'll hide. You'll never love any 
someone as much as he loves you and you'll never love anyone as much as he loves you and think of all the things you'll do together <laughs> welcome to <laughs> Welcome to Jonathan Bear's Playtime Forest. Nice singing, by the way. I'm kind of afraid of his Playtime Forest, to be honest. Television set, that's all what's there to be scared of. Mm. How about a red exclamation mark? How about Prime? First try. <laughs> I was afraid of that. Oh, wow, that's he a count? lot of damage. That he countered with the spines? Yeah. But that good did a lot of damage to him. Yep. It's like the game knows you only have three party members now, so it kind of toned down it a bit. Just a bit. I'm not stealing for that much money. It's not worth it. You could. You could waste your time stealing from Jonathan Bear's animal friends. Product grabs. I don't even know which one grabbed me either. Oh, I could tell you. Which one? Who's got their arms big and wide and open? Oh. While asking for a hug. I could just kill him. down this whole forest. Unfortunately not. I take damage from my spit as well. Because it still counts as physical. Take damage when it dies, so. Now we're offset. So it's bars forever. Don't worry about that. Righteous indignation. Yeah, it worked. Yeah, he used uh, what us in the Mecha community like to call Shining Finger. I like that. That's a, that's a G gun I'm referring. Oh. That's yeah, getting a little real. Yes, yeah, quite literal. They do not count as different enemies, they are the same. She's a skunk! Yeah, I know, I know. I wouldn't call it poop. It's, it's, it's spurted on me. You got spritzed. Oh! Level up. Yep. Vampire form.
The angle right, you can look right up to your nose. Extra magic defense. Hmm. Did I go the wrong way? No. I don't see any other way to go right now. You walk past it. I have a habit of doing that sometimes. Okay, cool, yeah, keep watching me, I'm okay with that. Now they have a tendency to just kind of stare at you. Creepy. Trees have eyes. All of the hills have eyes. <laughs> hills are alive. With, the with their eyes music. gazing at you. Fair enough. I realize I'm not John the name more, so I don't get my double items. No. That sucks. That's a great ability. Starting to get even weirder. And weirder. And I don't even want to ask. Oh my god, what the living heck is going on in this place? I think this place might be infected. I think they're doing more damage to me now, and they have more health. A little bit. That guy just did 200 damage in one hit. Like, what the heck? Oh, that invade actually worked. Oh, these guys are so much stronger than anything else I've fought so far. Like, so much stronger. I mean, it's not even close. Here. I don't even know which way to go. Oh, go to the left. There is a path. Was where you came from the left? Yes. Oh, my, uh, now I'm backwards. <laughs> Thought so. I don't like this place at all. Oh. 
I hope you Super can creepy. The boss at the end. Super creepy. Enemies are really, really strong. Jimmy. What are they doing here? This is a special place for just you and me. You can throw me away, Jimmy. You can lock me up. You can burn me to ash. But you can't kill me. I'm always gonna be right here with you, Jimmy. We're best friends, Jimmy. I know because when you first saw me, you just had to take me. Right from the shelf. While your mother's back was turned. Jimmy? Jimmy, <laughs> you'll never love anyone as much as I love you. We don't need anyone else. It can be just you and me here. Forever. Whoa. Jimmy! Talk about, oh my god! This thing is something out of a nightmare. That's going to do a lot of damage. Kinda needed to do a lot of damage. Alright, we'll do that damage from the start, that's also fine. Jank! Maggots people. And now he's grabbing Buck. Did we charge in? Mm -hmm. 990 damage. That was more than the stitching. I know. I think he crit on it. It uh, looks like it, given that last one was 43. Oh, Jimmy Spoop. different than I did didn't do this entire my entire playthrough what's that you're defending yeah it's good to defend sometimes. right and I would just plow through and eat the damage just so I could keep putting out more damage no it was a smart thing to do it can be a Berserk. good thing to do but sometimes you just need to dodge Berserk is a buff yo well, Mad Combo was up, and I'm gonna do that first. Like, oh, that oh, no, 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 I'm saying, in my case, rush it down. <laughs> Just do the rush down. Just plow, end it fast. 
Well, now he doesn't have a lot of MP, so I'm gonna do that. Nice. Got it now. All in. Woo! Okay, now level twenty three. Why am I ro ro rotting inside? The pulsating mass promised me more time. Oh, name drop. Jimmy, w we can still. We can still be friends. If you'll just come with me. Fuck! Well, that's not good. Today is a special today. day. Do you know why? It's another day I can spend with you. Was that supposed to be Jonathan? Today is a special day. Do you know why? It's another day I can spend with you. Today is a special day. You know what? It's another day I can spend with you. Let's play a game. If you'll wake up, I'll stop crying. The heck? Oh, the little penguin guy. Box Aww. equipment has been removed. What about mom? Well, mom's equipment hasn't been removed. I have one a bit world. Yes, you are. Penguin. Cool. Oh, there's mom. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.